just a piece of paper in front of me. My fingers itch, my eyes dance. Slowly, point to point, line to line. Folding, unfolding, opening, closing, sliding, turning, increasing. Each decision made with tips of my fingers, pleasing to my eyes, encouraging to my heart. Two dimension to three dimension, death to life, vision realized. We have a tradition in Japan when somebody is sick, we make 1,000 cranes to wish him or her well. So as a human being, most of us wants to be valuable, useful, and we want to contribute to a better society. I'm using origami to interact with the children. They come from very difficult background. I had also a um, painful memory as a child. My um, father was quite strict with money, so I was always wearing um, like hand-me-down. I felt like everybody knew what I was wearing and I was very embarrassed. I felt like I was the only poor child and uh, um, I used to get um, called a beggar. So those memories were very hurtful. Mm. I can't change the past, but because of that painful memory, I can relate to children who are sad. I'm able to use that painful memory for something better. Teaching origami, what I want to create is that awareness that our situation can transform, just like a paper. When you have a sad memory, it's a scar that remains in your heart, and it's the same as paper. Once you crease it, it remains, it never goes away. But you can use that line to make another shape. So in a way, it's necessary to have that line. Paper is a metaphor for life. You only have one piece of paper, like you only have one life. So you make a use of what lines and points there are, and uh, we can create something out of what you got. We all have infinite potential. Hopefully the children will also be inspired that, okay, this old person, <laughs> Not a very good housewife, but she can still do something. <laughs> I want them to have um, the sense of hope. They are part of something good, something better, something uh, valuable. When I do origami, like 1,000 cranes, what I've learned is that we do a bit by bit. If everybody does a little bit, we can make a difference. Not one person doing 1,000 cranes, but if 100 people, it's only 10 each. So then we can make the world better. If 1,000 people, one crane and 1,000 cranes. So that's a collective effort. And I think I believe in that. Every day, little by little.
Thanks to all of you who helped make this film possible. All of our films are totally crowdfunded. So if you'd like to continue to support us on our journey, check out our Green Renaissance page on Patreon.